assalamu alaikum guys today we are going to talk about uh, part 3 uh, in which uh, we are going to use our offsets that we got uh, in our previous video uh, to fix a safe environment of game loop ex like we will use those offsets in our exe bypass and we will pack them with the hex and we will fix that issue and uh, for that purpose i have already uh, ready this memory.cs file i have created it and uh, we will use this and some other codes in our bypass to uh, fix that safe environment problem using our bypass like we will pack those offsets that we found in our previous video so let's uh, open our project first okay guys so this was our project in this we are starting the game in the start game button but now we will not uh, directly start the game okay we will first patch those offsets and then after patching we will start the game for that purpose we will need to create a extra void here a separate void to start game okay and uh, we will cut these start game codes from here and we will paste it here like this now we need to create some extra void like we can name it to as bypass or something or we can use patch ex like we are patching game loop ex here Okay, so we will run this page patch ex from here from our button to click like when we will, we will press this button it will go to patch ex now what will happen in patch ex the, we will use the same offsets that we found uh, yesterday let me show you uh, this is the part 2 and uh, this was the offset where is the offset this was the offset that we found uh, yesterday this is not uh, exactly uh, the uh, like uh, the exact offset we need to add uh, four here okay this is the right offset and why i put uh, four here i will show you in just a second so let me open the game loop game loop is already opened let me reopen it I will show you why I added 4 there. That's why I'm doing this. Okay, now uh, we will need to run the cheat engine as administrator and uh, I will select the process game of EX. I'm just doing uh, this to show you why I added 4 before that offset. We need to search this as I already shown in my previous video. This method uh, will need uh, an update after like next game loop update. Maybe it will need or maybe it will not. Game loop can patch it. Okay, you can see it. It is uh, seven six seven six seven six seven six. But uh, here you can see after seven six uh, it becomes seven e like seven note uh, seven 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 eight seven nine. All are missing and it is directly coming to 7e385 so this is the right offset you can use it like this here you can see here address is 0047e385 so this 4 was missing in our offset that i added okay manually here you can see this 4 was actually missing here it was like this okay that's why i added uh, 4 here because i already i already knew it 
now this is our offset on this offset we will use this hex value okay so i already have uh, the codes here here <coughs> here this is the offset okay we need to use the 0x before the offset because it is compulsory 47e385 this is offset and this is the replace x and this is the process name okay here you can see the name of the process android emulator ex.exe okay so we do not need to write this dot exe we will just write the uh, like process num okay now let's implement these codes and uh, this code in our project For, uh, first of all we need to add our memory dot cs here i will add existing item okay um here we'll go back here you can see this memory.cs i will give the link in description of both memory.cs and the other codes you need to click on it and press on add button okay it is added here like this okay all the codes are here now we don't need it we will add uh, one code here that uh, i already given in my I, I have saved in this text file already you need you need to uh, use the this uh, this memory class here we are using this furious memory class here in our uh, main uh, form one dot cs now we can use here in patch uh, <coughs> we can use our codes here these codes okay okay now what will happen when we'll we will press this bypass a uh, start game button it will go to patch ex and patch ex it will patch memory uh, in this uh, process on this offset it will replace this hex value okay when it will be done status will be okay and then we need to proceed toward our start game okay like this now now the game will be started successfully let's try it, test it I need to build it first. Let's build it and close our previous. Here you can see it's uh, E9D8452C. Okay, it will change now because of our bypass. You need to run it as administrator. Like this. Okay. Now, when I will press the starting uh, start game button, uh, this hex value will be changed. Okay, because of uh, we added uh, in our ESD bypass. Here you can see it is changed instantly. Okay, before it was something else. Now it is C two zero eight zero zero that we added. Okay, and the game will also start. Here you can see the game is started uh, successfully, automatically with our bypass game started successfully and uh, that problem the safe environment needed also fixed so in this way we used our exe bypass to replace the hex value on different offsets we can use uh, this method to replace values in any kind of process like smart gaga game loop ld player nox anyone and uh, like it's easy okay now next uh, in next video we will bypass the game we will bypass the emulator detection using the same method our exe bypass but we will find the offsets uh, through ida from libanox.so so we will move forward uh, slowly slowly step by step okay i hope you will learn something from this video goodbye take care bye bye а я с Фандоримбургом, фонтанчик с черным тюльфином, и в жизни видит лишь раз его довозилась всем тем.